Hi guys! So I was requested to make a video about how to distribute your program. And uh, it's rather pretty simple actually, but I've never I've never done it. I've finished programs before, but I've never either even stopped to think to <laughs> give them out to people. But uh, this is what this video is about. So I just went and made a simple little program just for demonstrating, um, you know, it just with some graphics and some sprites, because uh, I'll show you how you, how to uh, include those in your distribution package. But you know, he's just chasing around for the pizza. Red light, green light, red light. But um, I'm just gonna show you how. To put all this together into one distribution package and give it out to people. Uh, whether that's open source or not, uh, that's up to you. But let's get started. So the first thing you're going to need to do is just make a folder to put all your stuff in. And uh, so what all goes in there? Now, the Just Basic has a number of files that it needs to run, including JB Run, the runtime engine, and a number of DLL files, which where are they? They're at the end here. This isn't the main Just Basic folder, in case you weren't sure where I am. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and select all of these DLL files and that should be it. So just copy and go to your um, folder, I named it Smiley, paste them all in there. Now this is everything you need uh, to copy over. Um, the basic stuff. Now if you have uh, other files that your program uses, such as bitmap images or anything else, then you should copy those over too. And my program uses pizza, smiley, smiley1, and smiley2. Okay, copy those over to right here. Okay, so what do you need to actually run your program? Now you need to make what is called a tokenized file. Um, so go over to your your basic file here. And what a tokenized file is, I'm not sure all the technical details, but it basically uh, ties it up into a neat little bow. So it's one little package that uh, anybody can run as long as they have the runtime engine. So now, uh, when I first started this tutorial series, I got one thing wrong. This 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 program is not called a compiler like other programming languages are. It's an interpreter, and what that basically means is that it doesn't convert your program into a standalone program. It it uh it, it must use its own processing system to interpret its own files into a program. But it's effectively the same thing, it just is handled differently. And I'm not sure the pros and cons of what goes on, but I'm guessing this is much, much slower than a compiled program, programming language. Uh, so basically, to make the tokenized file, go to run, uh, make dot tkn file and then name it whatever you want and put it in your distribution folder save all right and now what you have to do there it is right there go up to jb run 101 and rename it the exact same name as your tokenized file Oops. 
snow. Oh wait, the token has flowers. Also named snow. All right. Now all you have to do is double click smiley.exe and it runs the program. Ah! And you don't have to compile it or do anything fancy like that. All you need to do is install this folder on someone's computer and they can click this and run your program. And so those are the basics of program distribution. At this point you can burn it onto a CD and hand it to a friend. Or put it all in a zip file and post it online for people to download. If you want, you can make it open source and put your .bas file into the package so people can edit it and redistribute it under Creative Commons. Or you can sell it and make money for college. The possibilities are endless. And so this concludes the beginning programming series of Just Basic. I will continue to do Just Basic videos, as I have been, programming games and whatnot. But this is pretty much sums up all you need to know to get started in programming. My real goal is not just to teach you a lot of boring old syntax and stuff. My goal is to teach you the basic ideas, but then inspire you to be creative, and to have fun, and to build your own worlds inside of your computer. I hope you've enjoyed the journey. I know I have. It's been fun. You no longer have anything you can learn from me. I've taught you everything I know. Go forth. Program wonders. Be valiant. Congratulations, Master Programmer. I will see you in space someday.